Hey, this is Boy 4 z Got another video. Today we're looking at the Akai GX4000D. You see there, it's got the glass and X-Tall for right heads. This is a three head reel-to-reel -reel tape deck. So, got lucky on uh, Friday. Found this at estate sale. I saw it on uh, estatesale.net. And I thought I'd take a chance if I could score it. And sure enough, they were handing out tickets. And I was about number 28 in line. And nobody grabbed it up. And uh, they had it for 140 bucks in working condition. Original VU meters. Gave the uh, pinch roller a real good clean. The heads were really dirty. Um, opened it up the back, looked at the at the uh, capacitors, all new capacitors in there, or let me correct, all the original capacitors were there. I changed out some of the small electrolytic capacitors, 4.7 microfarad and some of the, the tens. Uh, got an order in the Mauser. Go ahead and recap that whole board. Um, change out some of those old transistors to make it a little quieter. I saw that recommendation on a, another video on YouTube, but everything is in uh, is in working condition. Control the volume through the output level. Uh, you got your track selector. One through four, three, two over there, tape counter, got monitor source, SOS, I forgot what that means, Big, Big Matt has a video up where he explains all of these, um, EQ, it did have the, the little screws, if I can take that off of there, this thing was on there pretty good. But there's a little nut and yeah, this thing's on where you can where you if you want to change the real size you got to have that and that was there so that way you could run seven and a half three and three quarter um but yeah play pause rewind fast forward I haven't tried to record yet. I do have a blank tape, but I'm going to wait until I finish recapping everything. See the wood, uh, the fake wood sides are all in great shape. That side is looking good over there. It's very lightweight reel to reel compared to this, this TAC down here. I have a TAC 4010S and uh, yeah, this thing is a heavy weight. I did a full restoration on that one as well. But yeah, that thing is a beast. It's heavy. But anyway, just a quick little video on the Akai GX4000D. Um, to me, even before uh, recapping, uh, it's just a great sounding deck. It sounds very good. You see the VU meters are working. I got the volume down. Turn it up. And what you're hearing there is you can find these old reels like this, these uh, tape mates, three hour long. You can find these things all day for a dollar a piece. And they are excellent recordings, great songs. This Polite Jazz is one of my favorites. I've been playing this a lot. And then I have Dance Time, which is another good one. And I have two more Playmates over there. And then I found another, uh, found a blank tape for a dollar at Ralph's Records and Tapes here. We still have a record and tape store in my city that's been there. I, I think they've been there since the 70s. But uh, yeah. You can see it's it's dirty. I got to give it a good cleaning, clean all the um, outside of it. I did have to deox the output volume. 
uh, control because it was very dirty. Left channel was cutting out, but everything's been deoxed and oiled up. Uh, just waiting on a recap. But yeah, that's a quick look at the GX4000D. Thanks for watching.